So, you know, when you've been drinking wine or any kind of adult beverage, and if you're single, you know what I'm talking about, and you're just like, I need a man right now. I need someone to hold me and hold my hand. That's how I'm feeling right at the moment. And it kind of sucks that I don't have someone to hold my hand. And I actually am quite proud of myself because usually when I, I, I switch to wine and beer because they're just much more mellower drinks. If I was drinking vodka right now, like vodka, my vodka and just any kind of vodka, or my Coke and rum, this would be a completely different kind of video. I don't even think I would be uploading. I think I'd be more posting just whatever came to my mind. But I, I like this. Wine is so much more, you're much more calm and reflective <laughs> on your life. So, uh, yeah. I don't have anything to say. I just really like making videos while drinking wine. I have no, like, comments or topics to say, <gasps> yes, I do. Thank you. I have 10 subscribers. Crazy. Craziness. Like for me, that's like having a million. That's like clicking onto your YouTube channel and saying, and seeing you have, all of a sudden you have a million subscribers. Like for me, I'm like, thank you to the 10 people. And let me look at you in your eyes. Thank you so much for subscribing to my channel. I don't know why, because the lighting here is bad. The spots are real darling like I can't get rid of the acne like you know I never say acne I can't get rid of the blemishes like the spots I don't even know what's going on with my skin like I honestly don't and I think like today I was literally like I think I have Ebola I think I'm coming down with it because I was like feeling like right now like if you can hear it in my sight like my nasal passage just never feels like this like it felt so weird and I'm hot all over probably because of Merlot but like I'm hot all over and I was I'm talking like this I'm sniffling I've been like it's been kind of weird and I'm like my body never does this and I threw up by myself today like well only because I was eating almonds so almonds makes me like whole like the whole natural almonds makes me a little nauseated but like I get nauseated but I don't throw up but I threw up today so I'm like wow I'm coming down with something and I was looking up like I googled like anytime I'm a hypochondriac like a major like anytime any kind of sickness is like rampant 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 I'm like I, am, I must have it. I must have it. Like Ebola, like the other day, like there was like all these breast cancer commercials. You have no idea. I have been massaging my breasts like a masseuse massages. I don't know. I have been massaging my breasts like pigs. It's oink. Like crazy. Because like they're all over. I'm like, do I have it? Do I have it? Like, I'm like, it's like the most terrifying thing. I can't look at diseases like because like I get really weirded out and I'm like, I must have and I don't want to call that into the universe and like put that on myself because God forbid and I repeat that in Jesus name but like I'm like Ugh. so right now I'm in my hopefully I don't have Ebola phase because like it's just everywhere it's everywhere it's like now New York I just read that this New York doctor had it and now these other people are coming out like oh yeah I have it too like this stuff is airborne I don't care what these scientists are saying this stuff is airborne and I'm like trying to be as careful as ever I'm like literally like you should see me like when I'm out in public like I'm freaking out like with anyone like I was on the train today and this guy the train is like the worst thing to take when you're it's like a, a like a epidemic is going about but this guy like literally looked like he had something and I was like looking at him like like and then he did and then I was like looking at him like get away from like and it was being rude and I felt rude but I was like I don't want to get sick I don't want I don't want what you have but blah blah, blah. yeah so I'm gonna take a little sip of my drink. <laughs> I'm uploading this. I don't care. This is very exposed. I'm exposing myself. This is like another part of me. I'm like, you know, you see like these YouTuber people on here who are just like, <sighs> I don't know. They just kind of hide things. And I'm just like, you know, your life is not this perfect. I know people have really good lives, and a lot of these successful YouTubers, I mean, they're blessed. I'm looking at like Kim Kardashian. I'm like, everyone that has some type of success is blessed in their success financially. But I mean, there are things that go on. Life is life. I mean, you, no one is exempt from life. You know what I'm, you know what I'm saying? You know what I'm saying. You know what I'm saying. And you know what I'm saying. I don't even know. I'm going to end this right now before I embarrass myself further. <sighs> Thanks so much for watching. I don't feel so lonely anymore when I talk to you guys. So that makes me lame and cheesy. Then disregard that. Strike that from the record.